Today we'll be distinguishing between types of solution, such as unsaturated, saturated, and supersaturated solutions. An unsaturated solution is being able to dissolve more solute in a solvent. An example of an unsaturated solution would having a gallon of tea as a solvent and having a pack of sugar as the solute. Now what I would do is I would have the gallon of tea, or have even have a cup of tea, and just have the little package of sugar and pour it in there. I would stir it and all of it would dissolve, and that's because that is an unsaturated solution. This means that it can hold more sugar than it already has in it. Saturated solution is a solution where the solvent is holding all the solute you can at a given temperature. Let's keep the scenario the same. We have a gallon of tea and we have a lot more sugar. When we are pouring the sugar in the tea and stirring it around, it will dissolve. But it got to a point where we were pouring so much sugar that when we were stirring it, it wasn't dissolving. That is what you call saturated. A supersaturated solution is the condition in which liquid is cooled to a temperature below which at, that at which crystallization would normally occur without a solvent resulting. Have you ever drank hot tea? Well, my family loves it. We like it sweet. When we heat the tea, the sugar we put the sugar in it, and sometimes it, it dissolves. The tea acts as a solvent, and the sugar acts as a solute. There comes a point where the sugar won't dissolve anymore, and that's its saturation point. My parents like it really sweet, though, and they turn the heat up more when they put the sugar in, and it goes past its saturation point, making it a super saturated solution. We're going to start with a half tablespoon of sugar. Then we are going to pour it in to 100 milliliters of water. As we're stirring it, you'll see it all dissolves in. There's no sugar left. This shows that all the solute dissolved in the solvent, showing that this is an unsaturated solution. Now we have one whole teaspoon of sugar, and now we're going to pour it into 100 milliliters of water. As we stir it, you're going to see it will not dissolve fully. This results in because of the solvent is holding the max maximum amount of solute it can. This shows that this is a saturated solution. Now we have 100 milliliters of water that is very hot. We will still put one teaspoon of sugar into the heated water. As we pour it in, you see that it dissolves quickly and as we stir it. This describes a solution that has dissolved more than the maximum amount of solute reached by heating. So this is a super saturated solution. A saturated solution is a solution that is dissolved in the maximum amount of solute. An unsaturated solution is a solution that has less than the max amount of solute dissolved. Supersaturated solution is a solution that has dissolved more than the maximum amount of solute reached by heating then cooling.